How about those Tigers? Woo! 48 to 27. It's your final score from Death Valley yesterday. Home game winning streak is up to 34 wins in a row. The largest in the college football today in the country. I was very awkward how I said that. But um, 34 wins in a row, another all season. We have not lost since Deshaun Watson was our quarterback. We lost against Pittsburgh by one point. And if they didn't make that field goal, it would be like 60. We even lost, we lost in eight years. Dabo Sloan has lost two home games. That's amazing. We lost to Florida State in 2013 and Pittsburgh in 2016. We haven't lost a home game since, believe it or not. All three losses on the road this year. Which means we're very due to on the road. So, got a road game coming up against a rival team. Y'all know familiar. Carolina. But anyway, let's talk about this game. Clemson defense was pretty good. I thought, you know, you got to give credit where credit is due. Wakes has a good offense. I mean, they're scoring 40-something points a game. Um, Hartman's putting up masterful numbers. They put up 45 against NC State last week, but only 27 against Clemson. Clemson has allowed 27 points. They've not allowed over 30 this year, which is pretty good. Um... Because they've seen some lethal offenses. Georgia scores 40 points a game, give up 10 points. Uh, Wake Forest scores 40 points a game, give up 27. Pittsburgh scores 40 points a game, give up 27. Plus a defensive touchdown. So technically, really, well, really was only 20. Um, but, you know, the defensive touchdown. Um, DJ wasn't great again. But he, 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 you know, he played like we should. The real reason we won this game was that absolute running game. And let's not even just... Let's not even just point to clap up Shipley and uh, Pace. Let's clap up that offensive line. You know, they haven't had a great season, but they are getting better. I mean, this offensive line was terrible week one. They look really good. Uh, they look, No, I don't say really good. They look improved, I'd say. Um, you got to give it up to that offensive line. I mean, those blocks were great. Um, but I think, I mean, last week, you got to say, man, we have 2.9 a carry against UConn. And you got to man, but then you got to say, well, you didn't have Shifley and Pace. And then this way you have Shifley and Pace. And look, no offense to Moffa. I like Moffa. I think Moffa's going to be a good back here. I just don't think it's his time and he's ready uh, to get the starting job. I think he's just not better than Pace. And Pace, and Sh- Pace is a lot strong and Shifley has that, has the moves. And uh, I-, I got a bold take. They're going to have just a good performance against South Carolina next week. I think they're going to run, I think they're going to run wild in South Carolina. Um, as well, I mean this. this I mean, that was that was the best game of the season so far. We got hey, we got we got a couple games left. Might have three more. Uh, might have two more. Definitely, we'll have two more. Might have three. We'll see. Um, so, um, what's y'all thoughts on the game, man? I, I got to tell you, man, that running game was absolutely phenomenal. Um, we've got one of the best running back rooms in the country. And, he, and I, I got news for y'all, y'all. These guys are back next year. Every one of them. Shipley back. Pace is back. Moff is back. All of them are back. That's some big stuff right there. You get them all back. You get them all back. Shipley, um, that we, def- we dealt with some injuries, guys. It hasn't been the greatest season. It's been a, it's been a down season for Clemson. We know that. But 8-3 and three with a chance to get the ACC championship with some help. And what if they lose and we go to the ACC championship? Going to a conference championship considered a down year? <laughs> that would be insane. But we do need some help. we got to have Wake Forest lose and NC State lose. So, I'll see you guys in my next video. And I want to say this for next week. Congratulations, to South Carolina, for going to, going to a bowl game. This is the first time since 2018 they're going to a bowl game. But I think they want more. And we have to gotta do the best we can to reject that from happening. Let's go roll those guys in Columbia. Go Tigers!